This is difficult to watch. New surveillance video released today shows this violent attack. This is in a West Valley IHOP. Throwing things, hitting people over the head. Two women were hurt here after that man apparently snaps. Maria Hetchinova live now. And how scary was it for those customers inside? And not only those customers, but those employees. And I talked to them inside. They tell me they were terrified as they watched the suspect, who happened to be a customer, start throwing dishes and coffee pots. This all happening back in September, right on uh, 51st Avenue and the I-10. As customers enjoy an afternoon meal inside this West Valley IHOP, a man in a red shirt suddenly grabs a metal pot filled with hot coffee on this table and starts slamming it on this woman's head. The two victims in the booth helplessly take the beating. Police identified the man as 47-year-old Joe Meza, a homeless veteran who, according to court papers, is mentally disturbed. A family with a baby and other young children see the violent attack and run off, all while the suspect chases one of the women he hit in the head. One surveillance camera angle shows her shocked with blood dripping down her face. At one point, she goes back to the booth to get her stuff, and the man throws a podium at her. But she fights back, and the two throw cups and dishes at each other. In the end, the suspect steals a purse and other customer items left behind. He also starts a fire on the kitchen stove, dropping a rag on the burner before leaving the restaurant. Police arrested the suspect who now faces felony assault charges, but he's been released from jail. No word on what may have set him off and uh, how those victims are doing, but certainly tonight we are hoping that they're okay. Reporting live near 51st Avenue in the I-10, Maria Hachinova for Arizona's family.